Hey everyone and welcome and welcome back to my channel and I'm playing ranked. I don't usually play ranked. I just banned, yes I banned Izanami, don't judge me. I don't know if that was a good pick or not, but I banned her. She's gone. I don't know what's popping in ranked or the do's and don'ts. When I play regular, I just pick whatever I want. And today I'm playing Kyra and hope you guys enjoy this ranked video. And without further ado, I'm about to get right into it. Waste no more time. Okay, so we're in the match now. I'm a little nervous, like I said, because I don't play ranked and people are really mean. But you know what? I don't care anymore. I'm not gonna not play ranked because people are jerks. We need to back up because they hit level 2 before us, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I have to waste my Aegis there. Apparently, Jingwei's like really good right now. I don't know if she's gonna be better than me, because I'm pretty good at Kyra. Back up. Back so, yeah, up. We were winning this fight if this is what I thought. You better run. And I'm gonna stop talking smack before I die. I was feeling really confident now that the game kind of started already, even though we haven't got kills yet. Okay, I'm a- y'all need to play a little passive ESET, but not too passive. We don't want them to know. I saw coming over, which is why I was trying to play passive, but not too passive. And I was able to get Jinwei, and we were also able to get Pukin A nice double kill for Dune Wayne in the jungle. Nice. Okay, they're already back because Jingwei has that special, the special move, girl. She got the wings. She be flying and stuff. Yeah, I do not know where she went. I don't know if she's over there. I think she might have backed because I don't see her icon up here. No, she's right I here. I saw her pop up on the map, which is why I turned around. At this point, I thought she was going to gank mid lane because there was a lot of fighting going on. There. Luckily, she did not. And I decided to just run. Hey, goodbye. I ran to clear the way. I don't know what she's doing. She's kind of like gone. Oh no, she's right there. So right here, she's kind of ignoring me. So I was able to get off a lot of damage. And lucky I was nice. Auto. Goodbye, Yang Jingwei. You have been dead. I mean, you have been... Um, I don't think you can say that on YouTube. You have been gotten rid of. And I get level 10, which is... Amazing. I do not know. I think I'm nervous talking right now because usually in casuals I would never be talking this much. I would never think about talking this much. Hold, hold on. I think she's about to gank. Girl, you better stop playing with me. That's what I thought. Back it up. So I just had to go mid since Jingwei wasn't there, but I guess I predicted where she was gonna go. I just have to use my two to secure that heal, and I was able to get it. Is that the middle? And I was right. hoping Jingwei didn't come through and like wreckers or something, so that's why I was trying to make sure my team move. But yeah, we kept poking trees and bow, and we were able to get I went back to right, and doing quite a bit of damage there. She had minions. Not you having all these minions left, and I'm still beating you know, them. I've beating noticed when up. I start talking smack, I start to lose. This is this is why I should stay humble. Not me talking all this smack and getting wrecked. Literally, she almost took me out. Oh, I might have died there. I mean, I might be dead. I wasn't sure where she was landing, but I noticed Iset was in the jungle, and I was like, okay, let me capitalize off of this nice. rotation. I would have hit her with two, uh, one auto, I think, and then I just got him. Thanks. So right here, Jingwei was missing again, so I decided to go, um, gank in the jungle. I was able to save Rock and again. Oh my gosh, I'm so excusing Bo here. He kept running, and unfortunately he got away, so yeah, that sucks. To, in order to kill her, I definitely need to play super, super aggressive. Let's see what she's building. Yeah, I felt like I needed hmm. to play aggressive. But. Devour worse, Atlantis. And she's probably gonna go demon. So I'm gonna get Atlantis next and probably demon so I can get some crit as well to counter her. This girl about to be. 
I think we do doing a lot of damage. She's about to do a lot of damage. And especially if I'm not able to hit. Because sometimes I don't hit my autos. I think just out of nerves. Because when I'm at my peak, I definitely do hit my autos. But. Yeah. We were just duking it out here. And... I was unfortunately hit by her ability and she charged me and I decided to use my ult, which was not the greatest idea. Dang, that sucks. I told you I shouldn't be greedy. She got all that attack speed now. Only reason she beat me there is definitely because yeah. I decided to use my ult and I missed my abilities. And she's just going insane attack speed, which is exactly what I need to do. Dang, she's like tearing me up with all that crit, man. You have to be careful because meta builds obviously are the best builds in the game. So right here, for some reason, I decided to be, you know, the best game in the world. And instead of letting my team do the killing, I kind of got too close and it backfired, obviously. Clearly, I was not killing anyone there. I don't know why I even tried at all. Okay, so I saw G1 was missing once again. I decided to rotate mid to see what I could get out of this. My team could get out of this. They would hit the vine. But I decided to charge under the tower. Make sure I didn't die. My PS4 cut out some vital moments there. But you saw that I ended up killing one of their team members. And charging me away. Doing quite a bit of damage from her. Yeah. And heat spam right there. Dang. She got nice. And Ravana still hanging around. I was able to take on that with my three. Couldn't have him getting away. Back to right lane, we decided to charge. And yeah, I just think maybe Jingwei didn't have her build together or something. Maybe that's why she kept going. I'm not really sure what was happening, but she was able to aim. Mm -hmm. it's like, I don't know if she had to warm up in the game or something, but got better as the match went, but it was already too late for her team. And plus, I think our team was better at teamwork than theirs. Okay, gonna get some of this good old sweet heal. Good old sweet heal. It's always great. I don't want you to catch me slipping, please. Trying to get some damage off. I was trying to get this choosing bow guy, but I thought Rob would be able to get it. I should have kept going for it. Oh, that's too bad. So close to getting him. I guess it's better to be at pressure and you're ready to get the right Phoenix anyway. So then we went to get the fire giant. And there was no contestant. No contesting us. We also ran to the other side of the map and got the gold Siri as well, and there was no contesting us. We had got their right Phoenix, so maybe they were just trying to focus on defending at this moment. I'm not really sure. But right here, I had to just my team gate right, I mean left lane, and we tried to play E set and use my ult. I was about to hit all of them with that ult. That was really going to hurt. Okay, guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Literally, they were about to die right there. That's why they surrendered. I hope you guys enjoy this video my last recent video is popping up on the screen if we all are having a wonderful and wonderful day as well if you want to watch this video this popped up on the screen right now i really really appreciate it thank you so much for watching this video and that video and any other videos on my channel and subscribing so don't forget to comment like subscribe and share bye everyone